Hello creative people and welcome back to my channel. Today I will be showing you how to create a romper with fringes. I love everything with fringes. Skirts, bags, shoes, everything. I just love this this feeling of so pretty. I created this romper specifically because I'm going to Alanya and I will be posting because I will do a Alanya vlog. Anyways, I'm so excited to show you how to create it. I hope you are too, so let's get started. To create this pattern you will need basic pattern for pants and for bodice and you can find that on my channel. Once I have the basic pattern I'm starting with the shorts and I'm measuring the length which is 35 and that's all of the changes you will have to do for these shorts. Moving on for the bodice, I'm gonna close the incision that's right on the shoulder as you can see and I'm gonna open a new incision on the side. I'm also going to lower my neckline with 7 cm and take away about 3 cm on the sides. For the material, you will be needing 9 meters of fringes. I'm using 1 meter of tricot fabric, scissors, pins, matching thread, measuring band. This is two different ribbons for the bretelles, you can choose whatever you like, and of course, my pattern. I almost forgot you will also need a hidden zipper. The first step as always is to place the pattern on the fabric, measure 1 cm for the sewing and cut out all of the pieces. Then you're going to take the front and the back piece and sew the incisions. You will take the front and back piece, place it one above the other and sew the middle line. Once you have full front and back piece, you're gonna place it one above the other and sew the part between the legs. You're going to sew only one side uh, of the shorts and on the other one is going to be zipper. But before you attach the zipper, you need to fold the edges on the waistline about one centimeter, so straight lines so you have a nice edge. And then you're gonna place the zipper. You're also going to fold one centimeter on the lower edges of the shorts, so you have a nice edge. On to the top, for the top uh, you're going to sew the incisions first before you do anything else with it. Then you're gonna place it one above the other and remember that you're going to add the bretelles as well before you sew all the way together. Then you will take your top and shorts and connect them together so you have a complete romper. You will take the fringes and I cut them uh, as the length of the top and I just place them one underneath the other until I came to the shorts and then from the shorts I just went all the way around. And this is the finishing product. This is how the romper looks like. Like I said in the beginning, I really love the fridges. I love the movement they create and it's just, ah, uh, I really love it. I hope you find this useful. I hope you found it helpful. And if you did, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Like always, if you have any other suggestions, please comment below. See you till next time. Hey everyone.